I'm training to be one of Mick Gleisner's underwater models. We have five girls. We've got six weeks. We are in the open ocean and that is an unknown beast. Don't panic. You have your safety diver always next to you. You're taking the eye off the model. People die. Doing? If this doesn't improve, you got to send her home. When it comes to the crunch, we just need to get that shot. This is our short list so far. Taylor back. She's 23 years old, five foot nine. She's from Arizona. Alex has been talking to her on the phone. She's a very sweet girl. Very excited to do this. You're I mean, a very sweet talker too. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> then we have Angie. Mm -hmm. Vietnamese. Yes. Uh, yes, yeah, she's very keen and she's got a lot of modeling experience as well. Mm -hmm. Yaya. Okay. What about Yaya? He's different. No, no. I don't like that photo. I like that photo. Get some more portfolio photos. I want recent photos. Little pile, little pile. I know she doesn't have a lot of modeling experience, yeah. but I love Shannon Tucker. She's not bad looking. Yeah, she's a nice, she's nice size. Good. Very good underwater. Christina, also, just above Shannon, I think mm -hmm. she's quite lovely. She's from London, right? Yeah, 5'10". Mm -hmm. She's also a photographer, filmmaker, she says. Filmmaker is kind of, you know... Gray area. Save the world. world. <laughs> actress, nice, yeah. yeah, I like her. What about Janita? She actually, you know, has a really cool look. She's nice skin. Yeah. If it's not photoshopped. Cool. Can try it. So it looks like these five girls are okay with you? Talk to them on the phone so you know they have the right attitude. This is not a vacation because I don't want to waste my time. Right. Sounds good. I'm Mick Leisner. I'm the underwater photographer. And I love shooting here in the Philippines where the water is not only clear but also warm for the models to shoot. It is so fascinating to take people on a journey into a world that they have not seen before. Underwater gives you a completely new reality. Gravity is suspended, stuff floats up, hair flows, and that's what the magic of underwater photography is all about. My name's Beck, I'm a producer for Mick Gleisner's Underwater Photography. My responsibilities are taking Mick's dream and basically making that happen. So whatever that entails, all the girls, Mick's concepts, the locations, the divers. If we have to get something sunk under the ocean, I have to make that happen, which isn't the easiest thing in the world. I first started with Mick Gleisner's Underwater Photography as a model, so I fully understand where the girls are coming from and I think that gives me a good perspective on trying to put all the shoots together. I'm Freya Jones and I'm the Associate Producer for Mick Gleisner's Photography. My responsibilities include training the models and assisting Beck when it comes time for the underwater photo shoots. Beck is really demanding and she has to be. Each group of models have different skill levels. Some come in and they are really good in the water, some come in and they have no experience. There's always one or two that are really afraid to shoot in the open water. It's hard to know how far to really push these models. When it comes to the crunch, we just need to get that shot. In the past, I've also been through the underwater modelling training myself and I have done a lot of mermaid training. I have done underwater photo shoots as a mermaid. You don't become a mermaid overnight. I have this idea that I want to pitch to Mick. It's called the Mermaid Academy. And basically, it gives models the chance to come in and be specifically trained to be a mermaid, living their dream. Meeting a new batch of models, it's always first impressions with me because, let's face it, not all models are up to the same standard. So you put some people in the ocean, they're going to totally freak out. You take away their air, you take away their mask, and it's a very foreign environment. And only the best can do it. My name's Janita, I'm from Sydney, Australia, and I'm training to be one of Mick Gleisner's underwater models. I've always wanted to try underwater modelling. I've seen models do it before and it looks really fun. I've tried it in my pool back at home, but I think this is going to be a bit more tough. I'm Shannon, I'm from Tampa, Florida, and I'm training to be one of Mick Gleisner's underwater models. I have limited modelling experience, but I believe I was chosen because I have a lot of experience underwater. I'm Taylor, I'm from Tucson, Arizona, and I'm training to be one of Mick Gleisner's underwater models. I've done a lot of runway shows. I've done a lot of print as well. Nothing underwater, that's for sure. I just really wanted to, I was really interested in it. I'm Angie Buha, I'm from Hanoi, Vietnam. I'm here to be trained as one of Mick Gleisner's uh, underwater model. I've been modeling since I was 14. Fashion, runway, editorial, basically everything. My name's Christina, I'm from London, and I'm here to train to be one of Mick Gleisner's underwater models.
I've done everything from photo shoots, runway, editorial. I'm out here to experience something completely new. I'm here to give it my best shot and see how it goes. For the next six weeks, there are a lot of temptations, but I expect you all to be professional. You can't swim. <laughs> Please tell us now. Yeah. You're not very dainty. If the scores are too low, we just have to send you home. This should be interesting. That's a fail. I don't think that she'll be able to stay here. It's going to be great. Hi girls. Hi. Hi. Welcome to Cebu, my name's Beck. You've all been chosen for your unique qualities, so we've got a lot to do. We are in a beautiful island paradise for the next six weeks, and there are a lot of temptations, but I expect you all to be professional on time and do your best. Okay, you're selected from many who would like to be here. Nick Glasner's photography is very unique. We are in the open ocean, and that is an unknown beast. So we need to make sure that you guys are very confident in the water. We've had the experience in the past that, you know, people are very confident. Yeah, everything's fine. They get out in the water and they totally freak out. This isn't for everybody, okay? So just be prepared for that. In saying that, Freya and I will be giving you guys intense training to make sure that you have the skills and the tools to be able to complete the shoots each week. Most of the shoots take place in the ocean, and depending on the client's need, we may travel to a location as well. Not everyone is going to be used every week for every shoot, so please be prepared for that. Any questions, girls? Um, where is the training going to be taking place? We have an underwater shooting tank, so the majority of the training will take place there, but we may also do some training in the ocean. Oh, okay. Girls, we have an intense six weeks coming up, so we've got a lot to do, so let's get to work. I think the girls' first impression of me is that I'm a bit of a witch. Um, I'm quite strict and stern with them. It's only because I want the best outcome. Models aren't the most conscientious of people, and they sort of forget when they come to this beautiful paradise that they are actually working, so I make sure that they stay in check. It's a tough love situation. The slower your heart beats, the longer you'll be able to hold your breath. I'm like scared. Hi, girls. Hi. Welcome to the pool, your first day of training. Don't worry about the rain. We always train in the rain, but we only shoot in blue skies. So we've got a big day today. What we want to do is get a baseline evaluation of your abilities. This is a very specialised part of modelling, and not everybody can do it. First impressions are everything for Mick, so make sure you do your best on these tests. He'll be looking at the scores, and if the scores are too low, we just have to send you home. So there's three things that we're testing you on today, and we want to see your natural ability. Breath holding, buoyancy control, and then endurance swimming. If you can't swim, <laughs> please tell us now. Yeah, let's get in the pool. Okay, girls, so we're going to start with breath holding. Hold your breath for as long as you can. 30 seconds, Christina. Is that it? Janita. 36. 49 seconds, Taylor. 1 minute 48, oh, Angie. Oh, very good. Well Shannon is just outdoing everyone. Yeah. Oh, yeah, thanks, Shannon, for making us look terrible. Shannon, 2 minutes 10, that's awesome. <laughs> wow. The rest of you need vast improvement. Yeah. On to the next exercise. It should be interesting. Buoyancy control. Now you've got to sink to the bottom. If you touch the bottom, you pass, and if you don't, you fail. It's as simple as that. Wow, she was quick. Yeah. Very good. Wow. Very good, Taylor. Uh, no, Christina, that's a fail. Uh -huh. Very good. Lena, very good. Okay, Angie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's a balloon. Exhale all of your air. <sighs> Exhale it all out so you sink. You're like a balloon and you're just staying at the surface and you're fighting with your lungs to go down. Shannon? You should just straight down. Done it. Alright, well that wow. was a clear pass. Okay girls, endurance swimming. We want to see how many lengths of the pool you can do underwater. You're not very dainty. Angie's like a walrus. Danita's done one leg. <laughs> Christina didn't make one length. It doesn't look like Christina's very good at anything. <laughs> Taylor, a length and a half. Shannon's going for a third length. Three. She's a bit of a show. Shannon's clearly outshining all of the other models. It must make them feel like they suck. Some of them do suck. I think they're quite happy at this stage, but I think it could get very annoying. <sighs> okay, ladies, let's get out of the pool and give you your scores. You can call them that. I mean, Nick's gonna freak. Ladies, the scores are on the board. They're pretty uh, obvious. Shannon was our star player today. Christina, not good at all. You've got two fails, so. We'd need to see some very vast improvement from you to keep you here. It's all about the first impressions. 
and unfortunately, Christina, it doesn't look good for you. I thought I'd do a lot better than that, yeah. So we're here, rain, hail or shine, 7 a.m. each morning. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Right, Thank you. you. Christina struggled the most today. Her biggest issue was buoyancy. It's not that far, five metres, but then when you're actually in the water and you have to think about equalising your ears, I think it's too much all in one go. There's a barrier, a mental barrier that I have to overcome. Emotionally, I, I find it difficult when I can't achieve something. I not used to that. Hopefully she can get a grasp on that, otherwise I don't think she'll be able to stay here. I'm jealous of Shannon, <laughs> but I think all the girls are anyway. the results of the initial underwater assessment. So this is their skills as they walked in the door. Uh -huh. Angie's actually okay as a first timer. Uh -huh. I'm in at 48, Janita uh -huh. on the other end of the scale. 36 uh -huh. seconds, she's got yeah. a lot of work to do. Shannon, professional mermaid, of yeah. course. Yeah, easy. Taylor. Taylor, 41 seconds. Christina, 30 seconds. Yeah. And doesn't even pass the buoyancy control. Yeah. This is my concern. Christina oh, has a lot of work to do. Christina has to work seriously. She does, yeah, yeah. If this doesn't improve, you gotta send her home. They'll be trained. She's in shape, right? Yep. I trust you. Thank you. but then there was a sandy area. It's really and shallow. Shoot 360. The fish are very friendly. That was You're great. It was awesome. Like yoga, it's like doing yoga underwater. She doesn't want to take her mask off. Well, if she wants to shoot, she has to. This is not good. This should not be a terrifying experience. So. Hi, Nick. Hi, everybody. We are up to Nulusang Island. Nulusang Island. It's absolutely beautiful. Lovely marine life, great corals, great mm -hmm. areas where the girls can sit amongst the corals. Great fish, lots of different types of fish as well. Mm -hmm. There's a cliff with a bunch of coral on it, so we're going to try to shoot into that. We would need the sun to be earlier than later so it doesn't eclipse that. And we'll also be doing the fish beauty shots mm -hmm. to see how they go. What about the girls? How the girls? Summer doing a little bit of another. <laughs> Give me fat. Shannon Tooker, who's just fantastic, and can do three laps of the pool underwater, so uh, she's Can just... she model? If cool. she can let her personality come out and relax a little bit, cool. yeah, I think she can. She's great underwater, but I'll be surprised if she gets the best photos. Why, why did you bring her in if she can't model? If a girl can hold her breath for three minutes underwater, she's gonna give you the photograph you need. I mean, she just has this way of smiling. What do you know about photography? She's gonna need to know her angles because from looking at her, she seems like she doesn't have too many good angles. Harsh, Andrew. I think she'll do okay. She doesn't have to really worry about trying to get her skills up in the underwater area because she's really a pro at that. So mm -hmm. she could work on her modeling while she's here if she needs to. We have our first test shoot coming up this week. I, I don't wanna do any test shoots. If we go all the way out here and we spend money, they need to be where we need them to be. Okay, right? okay. Yeah, no, they'll be there. You only got me for six weeks yeah. and let's be productive. Let's get busy. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thanks, thanks everybody. Thanks, 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 Okay, ladies, this is Ken Ken. He is your safety diver. He'll be training you on the long hose today. Most of the common problems underwater is equalization. Don't just like say, okay, okay, and then <laughs> you're like, you're not equalizing. One, two, three, last breath, and pose. The safety diver will give you air. Are we ready? Yeah. Let's go. So this is gonna be your long hose. Put your mask on, deep breath, but relax, okay? like yoga, it's like doing yoga underwater. Try to exhale very small bubbles. I hope Angie gets it right this time. Oh, look at Angie, she's doing really well. She is, hey? Yeah, she seems a lot more confident today. You're done for today, I think you're comfortable enough. Shannon, do you have that experience of uh, using the low hose before? Yes. Then it would be very easy for us then. On this, we don't have to worry about. <laughs> you can tell Shannon's really comfortable. In the yeah, water. her eyes are open. She just was smiling. 
I've had experience with long hose training, so it came kind of easy for me. Shana needs to work on her poses more because most of the time she just has a few poses with her hand up like that. Mask off, regulator off. Ready for the show? Yeah, yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> hey, Julita. Yeah. Ready? Uh huh. Let's go. Denise's doing a great job. Yes. She seems really calm. She's, She's actually good. modeling. Very good, Janita. You're doing a great job. Great job. <laughs> That's great. I'm a bit uh, scared still, but. I'll get used to it. I'm She's most worried. concerned about Christina. Me too. She doesn't have that water fitness like the other models. So this is going to be your long hose? Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Look at Christina. She doesn't want to take her mask off. Well, if she wants to shoot, she has to. I know. She's struggling. Yeah. You're still not relaxed. Bubbles going up in my nose and my eyes is putting me off. It's gonna be like that the whole shoot. <laughs> How are you feeling? I'm not panicking, but I'm not relaxing. I'm not able to relax myself. Just think of happy thoughts. Right, okay, back. So, right. Mm -hmm. This is not good. This should not be a terrifying experience. It's the first shoot. Can't wait to get in the water. One, two, three, regulator gone. And pose, 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 pose. Let's give it a try. I don't want to make a big deal out of this, but this is a big deal. You're taking the eye off the model. Nobody has responsibility. All right, everybody, listen up. Once you get down there, just relax, do your thing. You're all going to look great underwater, so do your best. Don't drown. Come in, base camp. We've arrived at the dive site. Hey, right, ladies! Woo! Woo! Your Go. time to shine! So there's these beautiful areas where there's all these little corals and some sand around it. And they're the areas that he's first shot this morning. The safety divers will have the fish food. If you're going to feed the fish, try and feed them down here, not here, because then all the bread's in front of your face and the fish come and he can't see you. <laughs> Mask off and adjust yourself and then one, two, three, regulator gone and pose, 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 pose. Once the first model's down, we get the next model prepped and ready on the side of the boat and start to take her down as well, just like a bit of a rotation system. It's like a factory here. Are you excited? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Hey Chris, how'd it look? Well, today's amazing. Thousands of fish. Thousands? Yeah. This just might be a good day. Chris is going to be out. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, Mick. Hi, everybody. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Yeah. Well, so, people. what's going on? Visibility is excellent. There is no current at all. Fish are very friendly. It's overall a winner today. Friendly fish? Yeah. I like it. Now, this is your first shoot, so don't panic. You have your safety diver always next to you. Your air is not on the surface. Your air is where the safety diver is. Just let them know that's the sign. So this is a fantastic spot. I've been here maybe five years ago. Play with your hair. You see the hair following you. Jump a little up and you have the whole thing around you, right? Also bubbles, really cute to have little bubbles, not too much. You know, that sells the underwater thing. Let's give it a try. Okay. Yay. Yay. All right. Camera department is good to go. Ugh, it's freaking cold. <laughs> Mix going down now. Let's get the first girl ready. Ladies, remember all your training. Don't panic, relax, and have fun. Shannon and Taylor, up the front, we'll get your shoes on. Louise, you want to do a wardrobe check? Yes. Fish food to our safety divers, please. One bag per safety diver. The safety divers should be worried about the models drowning and not about fish food. They are the ones that are in direct contact with the model. You're taking the okay. eye off the model. Yeah. Ken, Ken agrees with me. He's a safety diver. Well, He's in charge oh, of safety. They are the ones that are taking the models down, that are holding onto them, and that they are comfortable with. So they will give them the fish food and swim away. She doesn't agree with you. You're not in charge of safety anymore. Beck is. Andrew, we need all rounders. You know, not when somebody's dealing with safety. Okay, well, what are you when doing? When they deal with safety, people what are die. You doing? It's the first shoot. Can't wait to get in the water and see how I perform. The makeup and the eyelashes are just supposed to make everything pop more underwater. I have a great deal of experience underwater. I just don't have a lot of experience modeling. We've got weighted high-heeled shoes. They don't look heavy, but they're really heavy. Shannon's going down now with Ken Ken. I bet Shannon will knock this out of the park. Let's make 
make sure Taylor's ready to go down next. Oh my eyelash came off. Then <laughs> how was it? It was amazing. Can you see the photographer clearly? You can tell where he, he's at, but mm. you're more focused on finding the light and feeding the fish. We're getting the dinghy to you now with the model. Are you nervous? Just how I look or pose. Well, good luck with that. When I take off my mask, I just freak out. You know, I'll just try, try again. Hurry up! Get in the boat, get over there! It's my first dive. I'm really nervous, but I'm also really, really excited. I've never done anything like this ever before. I'm also nervous about the salt water in my eyes. Okay, Taylor's in position. We'll send Janita down when Taylor's done. Fog. It was pretty crazy down there. My eyes kind of were burning, but I feel like I did pretty well for my first time. Come on, let's get Janita in there now, please. Freya, I need your help. Can you keep everything moving up yeah. here? Bring them over All double right. fast. Yeah. A little bit nervous. Uh, I don't really know how I am. Like when I take off my mask and stuff, I just freak out. Good luck, Janita. Guys, Janita looked really worried when she left the boat. Let's have they keep a close eye on her. Can anyone see what's happening down there? Why is it big shooting Janita? Something must have gone wrong. First fail of the day. All right, let's just get her back on the boat and move on. How was it, Janita? Yeah. I was just a bit scared, but, you know, I'll just try, try again. I'm going to jump in again, and I'm going to try again and do great. Mm -hmm. Guys, Mick's waiting down there. Let's move on. The rotation isn't happening fast enough. I can't make it happen any quicker, man. We're getting the dinghy to you now with the model. Angie, see if you can board the boat at the back. Andrew just needs to just do his bloody job and stop questioning everything and being so argumentative. Yes. It's wasting Andrew, the boat is coming! Andy and Christina to the dinghy. Dad. Oh Hurry up! Get in the boat! Get over there! We're on our way, back. Are you nervous? Just like how I look or pose. All right, well, good luck with that. All right, Angie's in the water. They're going down. Are we sure the shoes that she's wearing are heavy enough? She's the one that's had trouble with her buoyancy. Angie, are you OK? Heavier shoes for Angie Muha. Wardrobe, heavier shoes for Angie ASAP. Bring the bloody shoes. Yes, we're bringing them. You guys are holding up everything. Everybody's got a comment. OK, they're trying a deeper spot with Angie right off the drop-off. Guys, let's get spare tanks on standby for the safety divers, please. They must be getting through a lot of air down there. OK, tanks are standing by. How did you do? I enjoy it. Did you use the technique that I showed you where you pulled yourself down with your arms and you exhaled your air? I did, I, I did. did. But then, like, if I do that, then I can't focus on posing. I try to grab on those corals, oh. and then that's why, like, I got Be careful scratched. of fire coral. I'm really proud of you. Good job. Good Thank job. Thank you. Are you okay, Christina? No, I just want to get in. Beck, we're putting Christina down over here. I'm really not happy about the fact that I am actually genuinely in pain here. 
Hey Freya, what's the hold up? All right, so are you excited to go in? Christina going in or what? <laughs> Good luck, Christina. <laughs> Got this. You go, girl. I don't think I can shoot all of you. Um, Someone's playing favorites. I don't like that. Everyone on the tassel, we're losing life. I want to yeah. try to see if I can do this. It'll be really sad if she can't continue. <laughs> Good luck, Christina. <laughs> Got this. You go, girl. <laughs> Christina's just gone down. All right. <laughs> Christina's down. Let's hope she does better than she did in the pool. Yeah, the sun's in a great position right now. They're probably getting some great shots. expecting your eyes to sting so much, but mm -hmm. you get used to it really quickly. I was so worried before you got in, but obviously you're tougher than Me I thought. Too. I'm really yeah. glad you're so comfortable. Good job, Christina. Thank you. Oh. Good job, Mick. Oh, I'm just <laughs> pressing the button. <laughs> the fish feeding. Yeah. It looks always cute. So beautiful. Good. I think so, too. Alex, what are you doing? Uh, I'm trying to make sure the models don't fall and drown. OK, it's just getting really crammed up in this area. I'm just saying, get out of the way. OK. okay. Yeah, Alex, off the boat. Right. Sorry, Alex. No, right. I want the next suit. I don't have red eyes. Whenever I get out, I put milk in my eyes. The alkaline in the milk helps clears the salt water out so your eyes don't stay as red. I hope this works. You know, I don't trust models. They only like, give you chocolate like they are your best friend, but they just want you to get back. <laughs> I know I can do better, that's why I want to go on this one. No, well, I just want to see if I can do it. <laughs> it's not supposed to be easy. If it would be easy, everybody would do it. I'm glad that you're going back. Just give it another try. Trust me, we've had a lot worse and it's worked out, so. Try not to think about it too much. <laughs> I'll try it. Yeah. Ken Ken's the best. You're in very good hands. Okay. Say Ken Ken. OK, good luck. Janita's a great model, and it'll be really sad if she can't continue because of this. I hope Janita's up to this. Actually, all right. Once I took away the regulator, I think that's what I was freaking out about the first time. I didn't want to let it go. I'm really happy that I went down again. So if we can get Taylor to go back with Can Can, would be great. Oh, shaking! Look here. Nothing to worry about. We're not let Very, it's beautiful light, and I think that's a wrap. Woo, woo, Thanks, awesome. everybody. Woo. Good job, ladies and gents. That is a wrap. So you've seen, it's not as easy. It was a great start, but we have a long way to go. And looking forward to the next shoots. Thank you. Thank you. It's not sexy. It's not selling the jewelry. You're saying that I lack passion and drive. You're set, darling. Put it in the pool anyway. You. Can. Things were to fall in the pool, it would electrocute everyone. We don't want him to see the chaos that can go on. Tomorrow's shoot. Good luck, everyone.